as any team starts their season, they are thinking about the game, winning, getting to the playoffs. But two Metro teams started their season thinking of others and giving back. Even with such talented athletes, it's not every day you get 400 people out for a high school girls softball game. But Millard West and Papillion La Vista's season opener is special. It is a battle today for blue. Bring two communities together to support our first responders. It's a recent tradition between the two schools. They pick something to support each year. And this fall, there was no mission more meaningful than Carrie's causes. Because they deserved it. She was a great woman. They worked so hard to do everything that they do. Before the game, we had just, I think, seven or eight uh, police officers, uh, fire and rescue staff. Uh, Ms. Orozco's um, fa uh, family had, had come out to, to support. They threw out a ceremonial first pitch. It, it's just been a great day. Through t shirts, wristbands, even water bottles branded to support blue, dollar after dollar will go to lives touched by fallen officer Carrie Orozco, like police athletics for community engagement or the Pace League. Anytime these young people can have an opportunity to give back, uh, it's a great life lesson, and, and that's what we're trying to teach our young ladies here today. Beyond the back and forth game, it is proof the community formed through sports counts for so much more than you see. On a scoreboard. By the way, though, speaking of that scoreboard, Papillion La Vista did win six to five over Millard West. Still an incredible day out there.